Alright, welcome to Venom! Greatest place in the world, isn't it? Quite beautiful. Check out the scenery. <laughs> Don't be back. We're not done uh, yet. Yeah, we are not even close to done. Time to show the monkeys who's boss. They're everywhere! Ugh. Yeah. What do you expect from Andros in the home world of Venom? Go dying on me. Well. <laughs> oh, dang it. <sighs> what do I have to say? I'm quite pumped up and. Well, this is incredibly intense. Yeah, this is incredibly intense. Especially being a no power ups run, as I stated. Dang it. I'll take the yeah, left. I'm going left with Falco. I've got the round. When it comes to alternate routes of pulling the uh, Venom, I'm not going to show it. Reason? I don't want to. I'm going right. I'm going to follow Val Falco because I can. Hey, Einstein, I'm on your side. I know! Just don't get in my damn way! Ooh, damn. I lost a wing. Obviously, if you lose a wing, you'll be beginning to descend slightly as you're flying through. And also, you won't be able to turn as well on the opposite direction upon the wings that you've lost. So, since I've, uh... Dang it. Since I've lost the left wing, I'll be able to actually turn a little bit better, a little bit more quickly in that direction. Oh, jeez. I'm just about dead. I am not doing that good. Oh, oh god. Not this. I'm actually kind of glad I went this way. Because I think if I took the alternate path, I'd actually take it. Ah! Harder path! If you want to turn a little bit more quickly upon the opposite direction of upon the wing of which you lost, push and hold the... Uh, the uh, button of which the wings actually lost. Screw it, I'm grabbing a checkpoint. <sighs> I just don't want to do this again. I really don't. Creepy ass temple. What do you expect? That temple gives me the creep. Yeah, this temple is pretty creepy. So let's just kill this guy and get done as quickly as possible. There's a wing repair. If you grab that, your wings will obviously be repaired. However, again, it's a power-up, and I'm going to try avoiding it. Also, the wing repairs actually replace laser upgrades if you happen to lose a wing, so... Yeah. More information for you. Okay. This, uh... thing... I think it's a golem. I really don't know what it truly is, but uh, this guy is actually pretty difficult for being a Venom Easy Path boss. Also, there is actually an end upon the uh, place, and uh, if you happen to reach this uh, end, you die. So you gotta take this guy out. Pretty quickly. I mean, not all that quickly, because there's still plenty of time to take him out. I mean, seriously. You can uh, practically go on for, like, several minutes. Another wing repair. Avoid it. Uh, no, I'm not okay. I am hungry, and I am dying. Okay, now that all the main parts upon the golem are destroyed, the head pretty much becomes red, and you have to shoot it. Okay, that was bad. Uh, yeah, says you, Falco. Okay, watch out for that. There we are. Again, this is really, really intense. Alright, time to deal the final blow. The back upon this golem will actually become uh, lit up, and you just pretty much have to shoot it. Shoot the back, 
and you'll be able to take this thing out. Come on, go down! Thank you! Ugh, oh, finally! Jesus! That took way too long. Whatever. I'll go it alone from here. Ah! All right, now it is time to take on Andros himself. <sighs> Andros himself on the easy path is actually well. I have to say, it's not all that difficult, but it's still pretty difficult, I must say. Again, because of it being a no-power-ups run... Uh... Don't wanna get on. Ah, dang it. Oh well. Again, things happened. I was kinda forced to grab it because I was kinda right next to it. Uh, this would have been really interesting if I would've, uh... Not grabbed that. And I didn't want to grab that either. Alright. Hello, Andros. Andros is a giant floating monkey head. Evil and creepy. Dang it! Well, that was a fail on my part. <sighs> what you gotta do is actually pretty simple. You gotta destroy the hands and then take out the head itself. Well, that sucked. <sighs> Am I dead? Hmm, strange. I'm not dead. Not yet, anyway. Oh, down to my last hit! <sighs> well, if Andros happens to eat you, well then, uh, you lose both of your wings and you take quite a bit of damage. Usually what I like to do as far as, far as challenges goes... Dang it, man! That sucked. As I was trying to say, what I like to normally do as far as challenges goes... Really what you can do is uh, shoot the eye and have Andros rub it and uh, then attack the hands that way. I normally don't do that. I just shoot the hands and then uh, concentrate on the eyes itself. Reason? More fun that way. Recording! Alright, I'll get in after I'm finished here. Okay, so, uh... Sorry about that, my mother was just telling me to take a shower. And that is something I am planning to do after I get done here. Alright, let's try this again, Andros. Alright, let's not fail this time. Here's a little interesting fact. Whenever I fight Andros, depending on what TV I'm playing this on, the sound sometimes disappears, and only the music plays. Uh, here's another little fact when uh, Andros is uh, sucking up uh, whatever is uh, whatever's around, and also when uh, if Andros is trying to suck you up as well, try shooting a bomb in its in his mouth, and uh, you'll be able to. Uh, Avoid getting eaten. <sighs> I'm actually kind of glad I died right there, so that way I could, uh, I could just simply restock all my bombs. Whew. I'm actually kind of glad I avoided that right there. Sometimes that doesn't work. 
usually what you can do to avoid being eaten is just uh, either shoot a, shoot a bomb in his mouth or just uh, or you can just slide to the top right or top left hand corner of the screen. Again, some that doesn't always work though, so keep that in mind. Ah, dang it. Also, when flying to the top left or top right, it's best to keep doing a barrel roll. And for some reason, Andros is invincible whenever he's chewing on something. And... Alright, he's pretty much down. Oh my god, it's a giant floating robot he's trying to make Pac-Man. Ow. Ow. Arr, dang it. Okay, just shoot the eyes, and there we go. Mission completed. And that is the end of the game. That's the end of the easy route, anyway. Well, you may be wondering, what about the credits? I'm not going to be showing them off yet. I'm going to show them off after I complete the hard path. Reason? Because I can and I want to. And that's just the way I want to do things. And, well... Yeah, that's just how I roll. And I feel like it's more professional to show the credits after the hard path anyway, so... <laughs> okay? I'm fine, thank you. Yeah, you yeah I did it. Great. Okay, I'll admit it. You did good, okay anyway, this is Drunk Goomba 1645. See you guys next time for when I proceed onward to the entrance upon the intermediate path. So... Yeah, that is pretty much it.